mankind has the honor of quite possibly being the most destructive force to ever hit Mother Nature. When it comes to protecting and preserving endangered species, human beings have a bad track record. Over the last 200 years or so, we have overhunted, caused irreversible environmental damage and have been just plain clueless. In this video, we take a look at five animals that have recently gone extinct. China's Baji dolphin is listed as critically endangered, but scientists say it may already be extinct. In 2006, scientists from the Baiji Foundation travelled up the Yangtze River for more than 2,000 miles, equipped with optical instruments and underwater microphones, but were unable to detect any surviving dolphins. The Foundation published a report on the expedition and declared the animal extinct, meaning too few potential breeding pairs remain to ensure the species' survival. The decline in the Baiji dolphin population is attributed to a variety of factors including overfishing, boat traffic, habit loss, population and poaching. Deemed the goddess of the river, the dolphin's skin was highly valuable and used to make gloves and handbags. It's almost impossible to imagine that the passenger pigeon's population, which in the early 1800s contained more individuals than all other North American birds combined, was reduced to just one individual, Martha, who died in captivity at the Cincinnati Zoo in 1914. Before their decimation, a single flock of passenger pigeons could have had 2 billion birds or more, and there were multiple flocks of birds in the United States. The nesting colonies of passenger pigeons in northeastern forests could be 20 miles across, with so many birds per tree that branches broke from their weight. Yet there is not a single passenger pigeon left for us to observe today. The passenger pigeon was driven to extinction by uncontrolled commercial hunting for their meat, which was desired by Euro-American settlers. The passenger pigeon's migration and nesting behaviour made them easy to hunt in large numbers. They were netted, shot and smoked out of trees with sulphur torches. Special firearms, including a forerunner of the machine gun, were used to harvest these birds in quantity. The growth of commercial enterprises was facilitated by railroads, which made it possible to transport the meat quickly to urban centres. By 1850, several thousand people were employed in the passenger pigeon industry. In New York, one operation processed 18,000 pigeons per day in 1855. In one year in Michigan alone, a billion birds were harvested. The thylacine was the largest known carnivorous marsupial of modern times. It's commonly known as the Tasmanian tiger because of its striped lower back. Native to continental Australia, Tasmania and New Guinea, it's believed to have become extinct in the 20th century. Surviving evidence suggests that it was a relatively shy nocturnal creature, with the general appearance of a medium to large sized dog. The thylacine had become extremely rare or extinct on the Australian mainland before British settlement on the continent, but it survived on the island of Tasmania along with several other species, including the Tasmanian devil. The thylacine is likely to have become near extinct in mainland Australia about 2000 years ago, and possibly earlier in New Guinea. Intensive hunting encouraged by bounties is generally blamed for its extinction, but other contributing factors may have been disease, the introduction of dogs and human into its habit. Despite its official classification as extinct, sightings are still reported though none have been conclusively proven. The gastric brooding frogs were a genus of ground running frogs native to Queensland in Eastern Australia. The genus consisted of only two species, both of which became extinct in the mid-1980s. The combined ranges of the gastric brooding frogs comprised less than 2,000 square kilometres. Both species were associated with creek systems in rainforests at elevations of between 350 and 1,400 metres. The cause of the frog's extinction are not clearly understood, but habitat loss, pollution and some diseases may have contributed. The southern gastric brooding frog was a medium-sized species of dull coloration with large eyes positioned close together and a short blunt snout. Its skin was moist and covered with mucus. The fingers were long, slender, pointed and unwebbed and the toes were fully webbed. The arms and legs were large in comparison to the body. In both species, the females were larger than the males. This frog is a scientific wonder concerning how they reproduced. After a male frog externally fertilized the eggs, the female frog swallowed the eggs and kept them in her stomach. 
she would keep them in there for six weeks before regurgitating froglets. No other frog, as far as we know, goes through such a birthing process. The dodo bird inhabited the island of Mauritius in the Indian Ocean, where it lived undisturbed for so long that it lost its need and ability to fly. It lived and nested on the ground and ate fruits that had fallen from trees. There were no mammals on the island, and a high diversity of bird species lived in the dense forests. In 1505, the Portuguese became the first humans to set foot on Mauritius. The island quickly became a step over for ships engaged in the spice trade. Weighing up to 50 pounds, the dodo was a welcome source of fresh meat for the sailors. Large numbers of dodo birds were killed for food. Later when the Dutch used the island as a penal colony, pigs and monkeys were brought to the island along with the convicts. Many of the ships that came to Mauritius also had uninvited rats aboard some which escaped onto the island. Before humans and other mammals arrived, the dodo bird had little to fear from predators. The rats, pigs and monkeys made short work of the vulnerable dodo eggs in the ground nests. The combination of human exploitation and introduced species reduced dodo bird's populations. Within a hundred years of the arrival of humans on Mauritius, the once abundant dodo bird was a rare bird. The last dodo bird was killed in 1681. So that was 5 animals that recently went extinct. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe for more countdown videos.